What is up guys, Jeremy here and welcome back to another video. So I'm going to be showing you guys how to install iOS 11 beta 5 free on your device. No need for a computer, no need for a developer account, uh, basically standalone through Safari and it's super simple. Now I do want to mention before I show you guys how to do this that if you want to possibly be jailbroken on your device, I would recommend not to uh, update to iOS 11. And I would highly recommend you guys to be on iOS 10.3.2. Uh, the signing for iOS 10.3.2 will be ending any day now. So like I said, if you guys want a jailbreak, make sure you're on 10.3.2. If you guys need to know how to downgrade to 10.3.2, I'll leave a link in the description showing you guys how to do it. Uh, but anyways, if you guys don't care about a jailbreak and you just want the newest version of iOS at all times, this is how you're going to install iOS 11 beta 5. So the first thing we're going to do is go ahead and jump into Safari. And you're going to want to come to this website right here. I'll leave the link for this in the description as well. It is tweakboxapp.com. Uh, just go ahead and click on download app. You'll be jumped into your settings application uh, asking you to install the profile. Click on install and then put your passcode in. If you do have one set up on your device, click on install again. Install one more time and the profile is installed and we can go ahead and exit out of Safari now and you guys will notice that the Tweakbox app is now added to my home screen so let's go ahead and let's open up the Tweakbox app let's give it a minute to load here you will also get a pop-up advertisement right there let's go ahead and close that out uh, definitely a very very cool application to have on your device I've covered this in the past I'm sure you guys know that we'll go into the apps section and then we'll scroll down to the Tweakbox apps right here. It says originally from Cydia. And as you guys can see, there is iOS 11 at the top. We'll go ahead and click on that again. And then we will be asked to install another profile, iOS beta software profile. Click on install again. Input your passcode once again if you do have one. Click on install. Install again and you will see that you need to restart your device so we'll go ahead and click on restart and then I'll be back once my device is done booting up alrighty guys my iPhone is done restarting so we're gonna go ahead and unlock our device and we're gonna go ahead and jump back into the settings application once again and then we will uh, swipe down to general and a software update and as you guys will see uh, we will be able to uh, upgrade uh, from iOS 10 to the iOS 11 beta 5. Now, if you guys still have the uh, iOS um, software beta profile installed on your device, you should get the updates uh, automatically as iOS comes out with new betas. So as you can see right there, iOS 11 developer beta 5. Uh, once beta 6 comes out, it will be automatically in your settings to update to it. Uh, as you guys can see, it is downloading it right now, and that's pretty much all you got to do. Uh, I'll let it, you know, go through the process here and then install iOS 11, and we'll be all good. Uh, I'm not going to let you guys, you know, or make you guys watch this part, but, uh, you know, this is basically all you got to do. And then once you're on iOS 11 beta, you will get all the updates as they come out. So it's a very cool uh, method of getting iOS 11 on your device. Again, like I said, don't do this if you want a jailbreak, but uh, if you don't care about the jailbreak and want the newest version of iOS at all times, this is the way to do it. Uh, but anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed uh, this video. If you did, definitely throw me a thumbs up. That helps me out a lot here at the channel. And if you guys want to see more videos like this in the future, don't forget to click that subscribe button. This has been Jeremy, and I will catch you guys in the next one. Later.